from the Kendida Civic Center where I'm at the city's annual Trunk or Treat event that brings all of our city's ghosts and goblins together to celebrate at Halloween time. Hi, I'm Barbara Ferraro, Mayor of RPV, and I want to welcome everyone to the Trunk or Treat. Trunk or Treat is one of our largest events, as you can see around me. We got lots of things going on for everybody. We have about 17 trunks that are here today. We got face painting, the Recreation and Parks booth is representing with fun giveaways. We also have plenty of fun photo ops for the family, inflatables galore, just a good time all around. The Trunk or Treat is just a fun way of decorating your car trunk and then kids going around for treats and prizes. All the organizations here today, we have um, some of them that are representing are Los Serenos de Point Vicente. They're the docents down at the Interpretive Center. We also have the Sunset Rotary. Um, a lot of city staff also came out and participated. We have some representatives from CUNY Deve Development Department, um, Recreation and Parks. We've got a couple of trunks, and especially our REACH program. Big shout out to them. you got to check out their trunk. It's amazing. Here's our Chief Banana, Angela, with the city to tell us all about this year's Trunk or Treat put together by REACH. Absolutely. Hey there. Welcome. We are the wildest in the bunch, so we decided to welcome you to the jungle. This was actually inspired by a trip I just took to Costa Rica, so I wanted to bring Costa Rica to RPV. REACH is a program for adults with developmental disabilities. We provide community integration and opportunities to build independence and socialization skills. We do in-house events at Hess Park, virtual events via Zoom, and we take our participants out into the community. So we're deep inside the jungle talking with some of our favorite animals. Are you having fun today? Yeah, yeah, it's so fun. Yeah, I love being part of Reach, it's my favorite event. Um, I love seeing all the kids in their different costumes. <laughs> and, uh, can you give us your, your best leopard roar? Roar! <laughs> Are you gonna show us how you act like a monkey? <laughs> Amazing, we'll have fun today. Thank you for doing what you do. My favorite witch is back here at Trunk or Treat. You just are amazing. Are you having fun? Yes, I am. Thank you so much. Are you here to cast a good spell on our city? Yes, I am. <laughs> well, you are magical. What do you love about this event? Well, I love, me and my mom love coming to Palos Verdes. This event is really fun, and it's good to see the community. All right, well, I know you left your broomstick behind, but give us, give us, give us a twirl. Fabulous. And you said your mom made your costume? Yes, she did. A lot of talent. Well, happy Halloween. Thank you so much. Happy Halloween to everyone here. And I'm Kelly from Supervisor Han's office. We're so excited to be out here today, hanging with the families, hanging with the pups, and having a good old spooky time. So, Tell us about your trunk. Oh, my trunk is a silly spider, and it's full of wonderful treats and tattoos for the kids. I just found a fun family buzzing around the event for the first time. What do you think of all this? We love this. It's our first time. It's really fun, for, especially for Anita. Mio thinks it's a bit loud, but he's fine, too. <laughs> Anything can happen at Trunk or Treat. We've got a transformer here. Are you going to show us what you can do? Yes, I can transform. Let's see it. We see a familiar face from the Point Vicente Interpretive Center representing Los Serenos, Elena. Yes, I, work to, we, I look forward to this every year. This is kind of one of the fun events, and I'm glad the docents are able to participate. So we got our spider in the trunk this year. So we're really looking forward to some good time today. And of course, you're here with Los Serenos. You do so much important work for the city. Yes, uh, Los Serenos is the volunteers that actually staff the Point Vicente Interpretive Center. We provide tours to ch school children and other groups as well. Uh, we also do nature hikes at Abilene Cove and Ladera Linda. And we also are the, the docents that are there for when visitors drop in to answer any questions. And of course, today I think you get to claim that you have the largest inflatable spider in all of Rancho Palos Verdes. Are you guys ready for the show? Yeah! Hey, everybody! Feeling very magical here at the Trunk or Treat. We found Elsa and Anna from Disney's Frozen. Are you having fun? Anna. Anna. Again. Queen Anna. Queen Anna Veranda. I, and this is amazing. Thank you for uh, decorating your trunk. Tell us about it. Well, I got inspired when we purchased Bella's costume first. She always liked Anna. So I'm like, okay, well, we're going to be the Frozen family. And then my husband said, 
well, there's going to be trunk or treating. So I'm like, okay, there it is. Frozen it is. So I just went all out. Super excited to, to be here today. You did a magical job decorating your trunk, and especially on a hot day in RPV, it's kind of good to feel frozen. Yes, for sure it is. And Miss Anna, will you give us a princess twirl? Let's see you. <laughs> I found RPV's building inspector, but today she's ringmaster at Trunk or Treat. Are you having fun? I'm having so much fun. I love it. All the kids look absolutely amazing. Good tell, time. Tell us what you did this year, because you do come out and get in the spirit and decorate your car. Yeah, so I mine is inspired by a crazy clown. So um, my husband and I got it together. We started two days ago, and now hopefully it looks like a clown, right? Is it looks scary and try to be crazy. With one of our city's senior planners who's been planning an amazing trunk. I think we're in with Team Spider-Man. How's it going, Amy? Good, great. We got a lot of customers. Happy Halloween. Uh, Tell me what you like about this event. Um, Is it fun? Yeah, be, the, because we get a lot of candy. Hi, we're at trunk uh, Troop 15415. Um, our home school is Monte Malaga, and we have our awesome first graders here passing out candy. Well, this is a really fun event. Tell us about the trunk that you put together. Um, just a spooky little Halloween theme. Get everybody in the spirit. I definitely found some dynamite costumes here today. Are you having fun at Trunk or Tree? Yeah. Tell us about your costume. What are you? It's a dinosaur. You're a dinosaur and you're here with your partner in uh, Dino Land. Are you having fun today? Yes. Happy Halloween. We're having a great time. There's a great turnout and we're face painting and yeah. What are you going to be? I'm the Grim Reaper. <laughs> so you're going for a scary yeah, painting. My is, um, scary. Now somebody asked me, what are you dressed up as? And I said, a pumpkin head, of course. And that's going to be a wrap here at the annual Trunk or Treat event. I'm Liz Brown Swanson with RPV TV. See you next time.